Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Coming up on this HGV News Show, we, are, we have information on the last day of school, Thanksgiving messages, and trimester two lunch seating areas. All this and much, much more coming up this Friday, November 17th, 2023, Gold Day edition of the HGV News Show. The news starts now. Hi, Crocker. I'm Ben. And I'm Raleigh. Let's go over to our top story. Hello, Crocker. Today is the last day of school before the end of trimester one. There will be many activities such as the turkey trot and other things in the gym and NPR. There will be war ball in the gym and in the NPR we'll have thank you cards and gratitude boxes. At 11, you will have bagels and juice and then we will all meet in the gym for the final assembly. In the gym, please sit with your first period class in the designated grade areas and we'll hear from Mr. Rocha. Have turkey trot awards and raffle for prizes. Then at noon, you'll be dismissed for your long week break. Have fun, Crocker. In the news, we have Thanksgiving. It is something that we celebrate every year in November. We spend time with family and think about how lucky we are to have what we have. This all started when, with the English colonists who traveled overseas to settle in a spot they call Plymouth on the East Coast. After a brutal year in which half of the group died, they learned how to plant crops and catch food from the local Native Americans, who helped them immensely. In November in that year, in 1621, after their first harvest, the colonists organized a celebratory feast and invited the Native Americans to join them. This was the first Thanksgiving and has become an important American tradition through, through the ages. We have some Thanksgiving messages, Vikings. In the NPR in your morning classes, you will be asked to think about all the things you're grateful for here in Hillsborough. What are you thankful for? We have a few wonderful sixth graders who, are, who will share their thoughts throughout this newscast. Hi, my name is Lucas, and this Thanksgiving, I am thankful for my friends, family, food, and my cat. And without them, I don't think I would be able to be the same person. What are you doing for Thanksgiving? I'm on with the birthdays for today. The birthdays for today and over Thanksgiving break are Esri, Christopher, Benjamin, Molly, Nicholas, Charles, and Albert. Make sure to wish these students a happy birthday. Hi, I'm Evelyn. And I'm Bryn. And we're here with your Take a Trip to Leadership Announcements. The Snowball Dance is on December 1st. You can buy our tickets on Monday, November 27th in the NPR during first recess. Bye. Hi Vikings, I'm Lania, and this is what I'm gonna be doing for my Thanksgiving break. I'm going to be hanging out with my friends and family and playing a lot of table tennis. First, I'm going to go to the Aeros Tour movie with my cousins, and we're going to have a lot of snacks and ice creams. Afterwards, I'm going to have a table tennis camp from 9.30 to 4 for the rest of the break. And when I am there, I will play a lot of table tennis and hang out with my friends. Lastly, I'm going to have a feast with my family and friends on Thanksgiving, and I'm going to eat a lot of food. I am very grateful for my family and friends because without them, I wouldn't be able to have a Thanksgiving feast. In conclusion, I am very thankful that I have everything that I have. Hi Crocker, these are the rules for the assembly today. Keep backpacks in your first period classroom, walk to your designated row in the gym, and respect the Crocker staff and the speakers. Keep your hands to yourself and don't talk. There should be no food or drink of any kind in the gym. After the assembly, please wait to be dismissed. You can then grab your lunch and belongings. Can't wait, Crocker. Hi, I'm Everett, and what I celebrate for Thanksgiving is my entire family comes together at my grandparents' house, and we all have fun for the day and help cook the turkey. What I eat at Thanksgiving is that my family eats roast turkey, mashed potatoes on the side with mac and cheese, and for dessert we eat pumpkin pie. That is what I celebrate for Thanksgiving. Hello, I'm Wells with, the, with your weather report. Today we'll have a high of 70 and a low of 53. Over the break, it will be sunny except wait, sunny or cloudy, except for Saturday, which will be rainy and a possibility of thunder before 10 a.m. Stay dry, Crocker. If it's raining today, we will have to postpone the turkey trot to December. If that happens, students will go to the lecture hall to watch a movie. Sorry for the change of plans, Crocker. Hi, Crocker. Please look through the lost and found items, such as clothing, personal items, and especially water bottles. 
Go look through these items today as th this is your last chance. The lost and found will be donated today after school. Go look. When we return from Thanksgiving break, we'll have an update on lunch locations. So sixth graders can now eat outside in places like the courtyard, the grass area by the lecture hall, the blue tables, or the new blue benches outside of Ms. Slater's office. All grade levels can eat lunch in the NPR at the tables, but remember that no backpacks are allowed in the NPR. Make sure to clean up your garbage after you finish eating. Thank you for your cro uh, cooperation, Crocker. Hi, I'm Chelsea, and I am thankful for my sister, and her name is Chloe. She helped me through a lot of problems throughout my life. For example, if I would feel bad, she would come and comfort me. My plans for the Thanksgiving holiday is that my family is going to Lake Tahoe. What are your plans? Thank you to all the students who tried pickles and voted for their favorite. This year's favorite pick pickle was the Zesty Dill. Coming in a close second were the pickle chips. Thank you to all of the pickle peeps who donated pickles or helped with the setup, cleanup, serving, and voting. We are sorry if you were left out. Pickle Day is brought to you by Ms. Mendelssohn in the leadership class, Mrs. Slater, Ms. Mooring, Mrs. Flood, Mrs. Parnes, Mrs. Grady, Mrs. Saucedo, Ms. Brennan, Mrs. Tran, Mrs. Jimenez, Mr. W. Gonzalez, and Ms. Enrique and students. Hey Crocker, I'm Adelaide, and this Thanksgiving, I am thankful for my parents who have made me a place to sleep, given me food, and paid for everything I buy, and much, much more. I'm also thankful for the teachers who have taught me everything I know. So Vikings, what are you thankful for? Hey Crocker, this is a collection of bloopers from the HTV Gold Day team. I hope you enjoy it. Hey Crocker, tomorrow's a spirit day, and it will be anything but a backpack day. Wait, we're do it again. The teleprompters just shut off. Yeah. My microphone's oh, off. You can't oh, hear me. Oh, oh, okay, Jesus Christ, Christ, I got it. My microphone's inside. Give me a sec. That's all for the show. Hope you. Wait, what the heck? That's. I'm going to take that one more time. <laughs> thanks to everyone that helped with setting up and running booths. Say thanks to your local leadership student for giving everyone a great time. No weapons or masks allowed. A PE uniform will be worn for the rest of the day if you have a in a prop. Guys! What's happening to the... See what I have to deal with? Goodness gracious, guys! I'm Mark with the Weather Report. Today we'll have a high in the mid 70s with a low of 53. It'll be sunny all day except for night. Have a nice day, <laughs> Sorry. Go slower. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm Mark with the weather report. <laughs> Stop. They don't have a high in the mid 70s with a low at 53. <laughs> Sorry. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't. I can't. Okay. I'm Mark with the weather report. Today we'll have high in the mid 70s with a low at 53. It'll be sunny all day. Have a nice day, Crocker. Signing off for the last time, Crocker. Have a great rest of your day. Bye. Bye.